Hey there Saints, Pastor Dave here with another weekly devotional for you. Uh, today it's starting with a reading from C.S. Lewis uh, from The Weight of Glory and the theme is about finding the place where we belong. As a color first reveals its true quality when placed by an excellent artist in its pre-elected spot between certain others, as a spice reveals its true flavor when inserted just where and when a good cook wishes among the other ingredients, as the dog becomes really doggy only when he has taken his place in the household of man, so we shall then first be true persons when we have suffered ourselves to be fitted into our places. We are marble waiting to be shaped, metal waiting to be run into a mold. No doubt there are already, even in the unregenerate self, faint hints of what mold each is designed for, or what sort of pillar we will be. You ever think about what your place is in this world? Ever wonder where you belong or what you're made for? I think our our world often tells us to find our place and to, you know, to, to self-actualize and seek our own uh, self-fulfillment in many different ways. But I think the Christian story is a little bit different from that. The Christian story, as Lewis is pointing out, is that, that we have purpose, that we are already created with, and our goal is not to invent it, but really to find it. Uh, my wife and daughter have been recently watching this uh, makeup competition show. It's called The Glow Up, and um, and I've caught enough of it. I, you know, I wouldn't say I'm watching it with them, but I've caught enough of it to, to get a sense of what's going on. Um, and, and it's really an interesting show. It's not about, you know, just regular everyday makeup. It's, a, it's really, you know, stage makeup and, and kind of transformational artistry makeup. Um, and, and what's amazing is um, how much difference there is you see in the different contestants um, between you know when they clearly have a vision for what they're doing and when they're kind of making it up as they go along and, and the, the you know the final product can be incredible but it's only when they know what their goal is what they're aiming for that they really achieve anything that's really cool um, and I think that that is a lot like what Lewis is saying in, in the reading about the artist who has a purpose for the, for the different colors on the canvas. Um, and each color has its place. Each color belongs in a certain spot. And when the talented artist puts them all together, they become something incredible, something beautiful. God is the artist. God is the one who has designed a place for each of us. We are the colors. We are the, the pieces that fit together the way that God has designed. And when we all go into the place where God has created for us, then we become something more. We, we become really what we're supposed to be. And combined together with others, we, we can do incredible things. But when we try to find our own place when we are colors that that you know don't really know where we go uh, really guided by the artist that is ourselves it ends up being a lot more haphazard and a lot less purposeful saints i wonder if you've given a lot of thought to what god's purposes for your life are if not maybe start with that this week maybe spend some time considering where God intends for you to be. That's your devotional for this week, and I hope it's helpful. I hope it gives you something to think about. I hope you're doing well, saints. I pray for you and ask you to keep praying for me. I'll talk to you again soon. Take care.